Dimapur is a town that closely borders Assam and is the gateway if you want to visit other places in Nagaland. It's also the only place in Nagaland that you can enter and stay without an ILB or in a line permit. So if you happen to be here in Dimapur on a Sunday, absolutely everything is shut down. There are no shops, no restaurants, nothing. But there is one thing you can definitely do and that is here a service at one of the churches in uh, Dimapur and the biggest, not the biggest but the second biggest church in Nagaland is here in Dimapur which is called the Ao Baptist Church. So I'm going to hear a service here and let's see how it goes. Dimapur is the ancient capital of the Kachari tribe that is one of the 16 Naga tribes whose rule existed before the 13th century AD and the ruins of the Kachari kingdom can be seen very close to the railway station. So friends, personally I think that Dimapur is okay for a one or two day stopover when you plan to visit other places in Nagaland. So, with the majority of locals here who prefer fresh local produce, these weekly markets are quite popular. In fact, they are held at different locations every day of the week within Dimapur. So, the most famous one here is the Wednesday Supermarket and it's located about one kilometer away from the Dimapur railway station. And the next popular place to hang out is the Chumo Bazaar at Chumo Kidima. <laughs> So friends, uh, to be frank, pretty much every market is similar with its fair share of fresh produce, vegetables and meats. And most importantly, apparel. Loads and loads of reject seconds garments. I mean, these are really quite good and seriously affordable. I mean, if you're a backpacker and would like a change of wardrobe, Dimapur is definitely the place to shop without breaking the bank. for more travel ideas and bye for now.